Hello, 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 YouTube. Welcome to The Real E. Shay. Sorry I have not been on this channel in quite some time, but today I do want to come back with a DIY. Unfortunately, this won't be a video where you will see the step-by-step, -step, but I will be doing a voiceover with pictures letting you know how to create this wonderful motorcycle design, okay? So get ready. Look at the description below of all the materials that's going to be needed to make this awesome blinged out motorcycle helmet. So as you can see the before and after picture of this helmet, the helmet is like a matte black color and you can get any color that you want of course. Again, check out the link below. So my customer, they actually drew the picture that they wanted me to make for them and they distinguished the type of color rhinestones that they wanted. So you need to be specific exactly what logo you want and then what you'll do is you'll print out the logo, you'll glue it on with the materials that I've listed here in the description which is the Mod Podge glue scissors. You're definitely going to need a printer and you're going to need some paper. So once you do that, you can glue your name on the back. You can glue your logo on the back. You can glue flames on the back as I did. And then from there, once you have your paper and you glue everything on as far as your logo and your design, then that's when you start adding your rhinestones to the very top of that paper. Now, as you can see, I used orange and clear rhinestones, and I have the link below as to where you can get those exact stones if you're trying to use those particular colors. Again, you can see the name on the back of the helmet, which you can also as well cut out the letters in Microsoft Word as to the actual font that you want and the size that you want, and then you'll just glue that to the back of the helmet. Now, to glue the rhinestones, you want to use the E6000 glue, which I have also put the link below that you can get. And this is a quick video of how the rhinestones appear on the helmet and as you can see it has a beautiful shimmer to it it is definitely sparkling it definitely gives a glamour glare and fashionable sense to your motorcycle helmet whether you are a man or a woman just be really creative when you pick out your design making sure that you know you put it in the appropriate places where you're still able to open up your helmet that was actually one of the dilemmas that i came across as i was doing this Design, I didn't notice that there was a part of the helmet that opened up in the front so you want to make sure that you look out for that as well making sure that you work around those areas that open up and that closes so please leave your um, comments below if you've tried this if you're thinking about trying this and if you have any comments or if you're having any issues and concerns please leave your comments down in the comment box and I'll do my best to try to assist you okay have a great and creative day. Bye-bye.